St. Vincent is a beautiful island to take a vacation, but we weren't there to have fun. We started coming five years ago. There was a group from the Lions Club and Medical Mobile Surgical Missions. We were on a mission. The main purpose of this mission was to come and help these people. With, you know, they can't afford glasses, so we come and bring them and we check their eyes and we prescribe them glasses so they're able to read. St. Vincent is a former British colony used to trade slaves. It gained its independence in 1979. <laughs> There's much poverty in the region. Many of its people cannot afford even glasses. When we arrived at the hospital clinic, the waiting room was packed with people eager to be treated. It was overwhelming in the beginning. Before we could give out glasses, we had to do a lot of preparation. Preparation for an eye mission is not a simple matter. The participants have to learn how to measure lenses, they have to collect the lenses, the glasses. Each pair of glasses has to be cleaned, measured. We use the lensometer to measure the prescription strength of each pair of glasses. Plus three. We collected the, gl the glasses with the Lions Club and we took people's used glasses from the community. We sorted the glasses by like positive and negative prescription strength and, and sorted these all into different boxes. There's a big pile of glasses. Some of them are uh, measured, some of them are. And then we were ready to give them out. He came here a few years ago. Rose, these gentlemen are going to help you. What they'll do is they'll they have a form that we're going to keep on each patient. It's a simple form. They, they'll get the patient's name and the age and the address and ask them about diabetes or hypertension and then the very short history. And then I have a blood pressure cuff for them to check the blood pressures. And they have a tona pen. Do you have a tona pen here? Right on. Yeah. Okay, we have one also. Okay, good. So they'll put a drop in with you and they'll check the pressures. And then, then they'll put them out here and we'll go, Dr. Suarez and I will see them and do the diabetic laser. All right. And they'll also, they have a retina scope and they'll check them for glasses. A tona pen is a very interesting instrument that's used to measure the pressure of the fluid in the eye. If the, if the pressure is too high, this can detect glaucoma, which can be a very serious illness if left untreated. Presbyopia is a common condition that affects everyone at the ages of four, around 40 and 50, and this results in a lack of vision, which leads to the inability of someone to read up close. Can you read some of the smaller writing? TYS. This is a very common problem in third world countries since these people can't afford even reading glasses. We had seen a few patients, however, there are a lot more to go. Obviously we weren't able to bring uh, the big machine you would usually use to check your eyes in the eye doctor and to prescribe glasses, but we uh, were able to bring these lens bars, which are just wooden bars with different prescription you know, glasses on them, and we would check them against the eye to see uh, what the prescription was. Hey, can you read this line here? Okay, can you just swing out the next one for me? Yes. What about the bottom one? Can you do it like how about? Patients come in with diabetic retinopathy, bleeding in their eyes from diabetes. They 
haven't had access to care. And the mainstay treatment is, is laser treatment to try to cauterize the new blood vessels and help them regain some vision. You're doing very well. Occasionally, we'll see a patient who's had cataract surgery by me or one of my fellow ophthalmologists in the past few years and has now developed a problem called a secondary cataract, a special kind of laser called a YAG laser is done for that problem. Look down, now open both eyes and look straight. Right in my... Look down and look to the left. Excellent. Dr. Garrett, stand over there and hit the light for me, please. After we saw the patients and treating them for glasses, they were sent to the waiting room to await further examination by Dr. They gave Silver. you the glasses for reading? Yes. 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 Okay, Step good. Two. So it's both things. We give you the glasses and get the laser done. It's yes. good.